Two young children are recovering in the hospital after they were hit by a car while riding an electric bike. The driver says she didn't see them. A neighbor says there's no way that she would have. News Force Caitlin Ogle explains. I felt something and I heard a bang. I thought, oh my gosh, I hope that's not those kids. What happened? Wednesday afternoon, a three-year-old girl and eight-year-old boy lying in the road, bloody, at Park and Quincy. And all of a sudden, she screamed, she just hit those kids. The, the little girl was unconscious. She, she wasn't alert at all, and his eyes were rolled back up in his head. Enid police say they were riding a small electric bike on the wrong side of the road when a car came. The children had pulled out in front of her after running a stop sign. The driver, frantic. I was just coming down the road, and I, and I suddenly just came out in front of me. They came out of nowhere. I didn't see them. I've never hit anybody like this in my life. I've never done something like that. Neighbor Terry Whitley believes her. It was very small. If they had darted out in front of her, there's no possible way she could have seen them. They would have been lower than the grill. She's also seen the boy riding up and down the street and doesn't believe the bike has brakes. He was breaking down this hill with his feet the entire time. I was telling him, you've got to get out of the road. Get out of the road. This is not, you cannot ride on this road. Enid police say the eight-year-old boy had serious injuries. The three year old girl was also very hurt. Both of the children were flown to OU Children's Hospital in Oklahoma City. Oh baby, I know baby, I know baby. So far, no charges have been filed. It's still early on in the investigation. In Enid, Caitlin Ogle, Oklahoma's News 4. Oh, that is just heartbreaking. The driver says she was only going around 25 miles per hour.